Hello, welcome to DataLighting.com. Today, this video will show you how to connect our RGB LED strip light with our amplifier and how our amplifier to control the LED strip light. And because I have many customers have no idea how to connect it correctly. Okay, now let's see. First, prepare the following items. You can see from the video that we prepare three wheels, LD strip light, two driver, one amplifier, one IR24K remote controller, one connector here. And, uh, and first, first of all, um, why do we have to use two pieces driver? In fact, one driver is to su supply power to one real LD strip light, and another another driver is to supply power to our amplifier because our amplifier can directly supply the power to the LED strip light. So the precondition is that the walls of the driver must be bigger than the walls of LED strip light. For example, this one connect 5 meters LED strip light with one driver. The walls of the drivers must be bigger than the walls of the of this rear LED strip light. Uh, um, for example, our 50-50 LED strip light, the words is 72, 72 words, 5 meters. So the driver must be bigger than words equal to 72 words. And the same as another driver, uh, as, as our amplifier, the word is 144 words and maximum the maximum is 100 and 144 words so the driver must be bigger than that must be bigger than 144 words so that we can make sure that the other strip light will be working okay now i will show it to you how to connect it correctly here there are two ends on on our LED controller one end plug plug in one one end with our driver and another end connect with the LED strip light you can see here plug in like this and another end you will see there are two arrows there are two arrows on the connector here so when we connect it you need to connect the error point correctly here or else the other strip light will not be working the same as the other side here and and we come to another end of the other strip line another end connect directly with with the input input side of the amplifier here you can see there is inputs input side mark here connect with with five meters LD strip line. Why do we have to pay attention to this? Because the the in, the input side determine the LD strip line can be controlled. The five meter LD strip line can be controlled with one controller. And there is one hole on the input side too and you you need to connect the connector with this hole and and we come to the output side here the output side you can see here the output side and connect with the 10 meter LT strip line you see here 5 meter one end connect correctly with the mark with the mark here the different mark with different colors and the black wire with the positive point the input the input side is the input side positive point and then let's see if the LD strip light will be working in with with our controller turn on the switch you see the other chip line will start to work and here is the switch on the board 
turn off the switch and turn on the switch but when we use this controller we need to be directly at the end of the controller here the IR24 controller be directly at this at this at this wire uh, because it is because it can it can search the signal here so that we can control all the LTG lights with only one remote controller and then you can choose the color you like um, by pressing the different key here represent the different color the blue one the pink yellow red etc and and you you can try it by yourself and, and one more thing here if you wanna if you wanna control connect more LTG light and you can you can con continue to connect the LTG light with one more amplifier one more driver to to supply the power just like the previous one and over and over again uh, with only one controller.